hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm showing how to install windows 11 so i already um, added the iso file on my virtual machine um, this is only for testing purposes I'm not gonna use it in the production environment as the official um, Windows 11 is not out that's why I'm using a um, virtual machine for testing so I will put the link in the description for downloading the Windows 11 now you will see a screen like this it's almost similar to the screen that we have seen in windows 10 so we're gonna choose languages i'm gonna go with the us english and click on install now so we'll get a um, window like this setup is starting that's fine i have given um, 4 gb ram on this uh, machine and for testing i give only 30 gb of disk space um, when you are testing make sure you give like at least 4 gb of ram and i don't have a product key right now so i just will uh, skip this option and it will give me a couple of options like which operating system you want to install uh, it has all the major flavors available so i'll go with the windows 11 pro click on next there will be a license agreement you need to uh, uh, accept the license agreement click on next and here you have two options upgrade and custom install so i'm gonna go with the custom option so it will as i told 30 gb is there so just click on new and apply all right so um it create three partitions that's fine uh, two of them is for system and one for primary as a C drive click on next now it started copying the files and everything getting files ready for installation uh, the procedure is very simple same like windows 10 installation we're gonna wait for um, installation to finish so just pause the video to finish it Um, just 22 percentage is finished as of now we will wait for it to finish so it has just finished the um, um, feature installation and three steps are finished now it's installing updates and it will finish up after the next step so we're gonna wait for it to finish now it, it's completely installed the windows 11 now it's asking um, waiting for the restart automatically it will restart in uh, 10 seconds so uh, it's restarting the computer let's wait for the reboot if you have a good amount of ram you can give like 8 gb so that it will be much faster and also it is advised to have a solid state drive instead of the normal hard disk now it's booting to windows 11 this is my first time usage i just recorded the video for um, you to see that how it looks i'm gonna be making um i'll be making a couple of videos related to windows 11 Do subscribe the channel and click the bell icon for the notifications uh, it looks almost similar to the windows 10 but the logo uh, it, it remind me like uh, windows 8 actually windows 8 is a filed one so we hope windows 11 will not be like this it, it should be a stable version because it's releasing after a couple of years after windows 10 has 
uh, gone stable. Now let's wait for it to finish. It is getting ready. So uh, it's asking for the country. I'm going to choose US. Click on yes. It reminds me the Ubuntu installation. Keyboard layout also, I'm going to choose English, US. I don't want to add any other layout right now. Skip. So it's asking for uh, personal use. I will choose setup for personal use and click on next. So I will not create an account here. I'm just going to go to the sign in option and will create an offline account. Sign in and create account. Um, I just click on limited experience. So here I will give my name or except for example user and password you're gonna choose simple password click on next again confirmation click on next security question i just choose nil since and um, it's only for testing purpose in your case you can give a proper answers for the security questions so i'll just disable all this location find my device and advertising id and all this click on accept after that So it's a similar message like Windows 10, getting things ready and all these introduction messages. This might take a few minutes, don't turn off your PC, that's fine. Let's wait for a few minutes to get it finished. Okay, here we are. Um, you can see a um, list of application here. Click on all apps to see the complete programs. So I think it's more like a mobile interface. This is the desktop. And this is very cool. So um, in coming videos, we'll just explain more about the Windows 11. Hope you understood how to install Windows 11. Thank you for watching. Subscribe the channel. Click the bell icon for notification. Take care. Goodbye.